what I decided to do was to ask our friends what they thought when they hear your name. All our friends really enjoyed talking about you, like usual. So, I hope you enjoy it, babe. So, when you hear the name David Famachan, what do you think about? David Famachan. The things I think of when I think of Famachan. I don't know a David Famachan. I know a Fom. When I think of David Famachan. Fom Fom. Papachan. Uh, what comes to mind when you think of David Famachan? Stupid thing. Everyone that knows him, everyone that's close to him, calls him by those names. So. Actually, I don't think I've ever said his real name. Oh, hey, see you there. What's that? What do I think of when I think of David Fong? Your fong is. Think about Fong. David Fong. When I think of David, who is David Fong? David Fong. The first time I heard Fong Chan's name, I thought it was Farmer Chan. It's Fong. When I think about him, I don't really like him. What comes to mind when I think of David Fomachan? If you think you're special, you're probably not. Why, why, why even try? It was kind of a while when I didn't know it was Fama Chan, not Farmer Chan. I apologize. I think of loyalty, honor, friendship, trust. Big dick for beef jerky. Back in the day, Dave, let me borrow like five dollars for some Wendy's. It took me about three months to pay it back, but I did. But last name from a charm kind of sounds like an anime character, bro. And he took it as if I paid him back the very next day. That is <laughs> a true friend. In a heart so big, just can't take shit. He sucks at skating. He sucks so bad at skating. Fucking terrible. Seen in Beer Fest, where one guy's got to get so blacked out drunk to remember where Beer, Fe Beer Fest is actually located. That's the Fomachan. You gotta get so fucked up to remember where Beer Fest is at. Fom is a very quiet guy, but let's be honest here, you're pretty ratchet. <laughs> of course, the best memory that we have of you is that one party where you just stumbled through at three in the morning and, you know, spilled a little bit of booze. But you know what? You licked that shit up. You licked it well, buddy. And then proceeds to take off his shirt to wipe it off in front of a group of people he doesn't really know that well. And I will never forget that. Bro, Machan, you know, skateboarding by day, hanging out ass looking by night with a big ass bro, bro. Hear that, Bob? I think of you, I think of Godzilla. Doja David and going to Taco Bell and eating a lot of food and taking a nasty ass shit the morning after. He likes to throw up you know, bar tops outside of windows, outside of tent windows. But he's a good guy. Peoples. He keeps it real. Don't do school, eat your drugs, and stay in vegetables. Sweet and sour for that ass. <laughs> for that chicken ass. <laughs> Bomb is like Tigger, especially when he's fucked up. Because that's what David is to me. He's my brother. Honestly, since the first time I met David Bomb and Chan, I knew we were going to be friends for life. One of the nicest guys that I've ever met. I appreciate how happy he is when whenever I see him. Sometimes when I see him, it's like, you know, what's your deal? Are you always in a fucking good mood for? Are you ever in a bad mood for him, Chan? 
How about you try being a bad one? And although we've only been friends for a few years now, it feels like I've known him my whole life. And that doesn't happen very often, so. So, always try to return a favor. Every time I see him, try to be happy to see him as well. That's what I really like. David Falmachan. Yeah, it was romantic. Think about his lovely Chinese knees. I heard Bamba Chan can sit in the corner of the circle room. His lovely Chinese earlobes. Fom is a professional dancer. Skater? I think. Almost. His lovely Chinese elbows. This memorable party we went to together was at EFSO, the trance event. You were fucked up, and so was I. And that's Doja David for sure. And he makes really good pornos. Fom is just crazy. <laughs> <laughs> but to me, you always be a little chubby kid, long, long hair split down the middle with that bright ass orange Texas shirt, man. With your little monkey skateboard. I love his smile. I love his knees. I love his heart shaped birthmark he has by his neck. I love the way he sleeps. She's like the wind. I love the way how I think of that song every time I think of him. Ball and all, I really love Bomb's hair. That majestic hair. I think he's um, extremely good looking, and maybe he should do that as a career, being ridiculously good looking. It looks like cotton candy. I think it might be too airy. But it works for him. That's what matters. He's always doing that fucking hair whip. Like, what's the deal with the hair whip? Styling. Same as always. Always styling. I don't know. Damn. That's what I was gonna say. Also, really great at combing his fingers through his hair. No one does it better. David Famachan. I wish my hair was as nice as his. Possible. He is really sweet and genuine, always willing to help me with all my cloud problems. I think of a cross between a donkey and an onion. A pizza mask so fine, it'll bring a tear to my Don't know if you can see me well, but check out this view. It's beautiful. It's not very often you meet guys like David Pomachan. We've done so much together in the past, I don't know, four or five years that I've known Bob. He was there for me when I needed him, even before we really knew each other. I'm one of the nicest guys I know, genuine, great friend, fun to be around. You know, all that other bullshit, but he's a douche. But from what I hear, you are always down for your family and your friends, and that's a really good quality. So I think you have a good day. David will forever be my blonde tip egg roll eating Chinese drifter. But anyways, I wanted to say happy birthday. I love you very much. You know, you're growing up to be a fucking great man. A little gay Morrissey haircut. Still handsome though. And I hope you know how important you are to me and how much I value our friendship. Um, Sorry I couldn't be there for your 27th birthday, but I'll be home shortly and um, we can celebrate it once I get home. And you know, we hang out from time to time and you know what? You're a cool dude. Um, I think I'm going to buy him a beer like right now. Jan coming at you. Fum. You're one of those guys that when I met him, I thought, hey, this guy's quiet, kind of boring. Two girls go grass. But as I got to know you and saw how drunk you can get, I thought to myself, man, wish I would have met this guy before I had a girlfriend. Alright, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, David. We just wanted to wish you a happy birthday. Happy birthday, David. Love you, man. Happy birthday. Hey, happy birthday, David. Fama Chan. Happy birthday, Fama. Hey, David. Just wanted to say happy birthday. Happy birthday, David. Happy birthday, buddy. But first and foremost, man, I love you. 
Happy birthday, here's a shot for me. Love you, baby. Happy birthday, buddy. We all love you. Oh, you wish, you wish. Uh. David, I know we talk a lot of shit, dude, but you're one of my best friends. I can always rely on you. I fucking love you, man. Hey, get back to work! <laughs> Gotta get back to work. <laughs> and I hope you're ready for your birthday. We're gonna make you either throw up at the bar or twerk on everyone. Oh wait, you've done all those for your birthdays. I uh, have no feelings to say. <laughs> no comment, that's it, no comment. No comment, no comment. No comment. We are still on the hunt for David Farmer-Chan. Haven't seen him in a while. Last time we saw him, uh, Hops and Lions, Sharks games, a couple of shows. Some people say they saw him on a rock, bouncing on a cock. If you see him, let us know. The number's 911. Farmer-Chan.